Hey guys, today I want to share with you guys the battery results test of iOS 11.0.3 versus iOS 11.1. This week, Apple is set to be releasing this software to the general public, but Apple has yet to enable the iMessages within iCloud, which is a feature that's set to be making its debut with this software. So we could see maybe a minor tweak before its official launch, but we don't have the iMessages in iCloud or the peer-to-peer -peer payment yet on these devices. But anyway, the purpose of this video is to test the battery. As we know, iOS 11.0 all the way to the current 11.0.3, all iPhones have been struggling with battery performance, have been testing these performance beta after beta, release after release. And now, I think iOS 11.1 beta 4 or gold master which is pretty much going to be the official release I wanted to test it and put it to the test to see how it is performing so let's go ahead and take a look at the first time lapse that I have for you guys now from left to right we have iPhone uh, 6 plus 7 plus and 8 plus okay so on the left the iPhone 6 plus died at 4 hours and 45 minutes that's going to be iOS 11.0.3 also the iPhone 7 plus died a little earlier at 4 hours and 5 minutes which is kind of crazy and the iPhone 8 plus at 4 hours and 40 minutes now I want you guys to keep in mind these tests are performed identical okay so the brightness is the same everything is identical even when I update the devices to test the next version of the software of course the brightness is going to be the same all the settings nothing has changed at all now one thing i want to do clarify is that these tests just give us a general information on how much the battery could last us on a day-to-day -day basis of course your device won't have the display on at all times as i do for these tests in order to get the clocks application running to get the stopwatch going so you're not going to have the display on at all times and also some of you guys also use low power mode in some instances which i don't use in these tests i just want to get the raw power of the battery with the device display on to see how long it would last and the tasks are the same on all devices so pretty much if you get let's say eight hours every day out of your iPhone and on 11.1 for this test I tell you you know this device gave us an extra 30 to 40 minutes of extra on-screen time then that means when you update most likely you will see anywhere from a half hour to maybe 45 minutes of extra on-screen time it doesn't mean that it's gonna last four hours as you saw on this video because the display is on as I mentioned the brightness is up and you know it's currently running so just keep that in mind so here's the second time lapse again from left to right iphone 6 plus 7 plus and 8 plus now the first device to die on 11.1 was the iphone 7 plus with six hours and 50 minutes of on-screen time which beats the previous uh, time by two hours approximately two hours and a half approximately that you can get out of 11.1 versus previous versions on the iphone 6 plus seven hours and 40 minutes which also beats the previous by a good three hours or so so you're going to probably get a good two and a half to three hours of extra on-screen time when you update to ios 11.1 and the iphone 8 plus was the most surprising to me it died at eight hours and 55 minutes that's three hours plus on this device when you update to 11.1 and i thought these results were rather drastic so i ran them twice and twice i got the same results ios 11.1 the gold master copy or beta 4 definitely definitely improves the battery on all of these devices that you just saw now i'm going to be adding more devices in the future i know you guys want to see the iphone se as well so i'm just kind of working uh, to get some more devices here in the house because i have other iphones but they're running different softwares which i can't update for several reasons but i'm going to go ahead and grab a few other devices here hopefully in the next couple of days to keep adding some of these devices and provide some more of this information for you guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video and found this information helpful it's been a device help and i'll see you real soon peace